Hi guys, welcome to my channel and today I am basically going to be taking off my makeup with you, taking off my makeup with me. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to be taking off this makeup look. I didn't do this makeup look on camera because I just thought I wanted to do one off camera and see how well it goes. Um, I don't know if you can see the colours, but it's like a light blue, then a darker blue, then green. It's a, it's, been, it's gone pretty good. I actually can like it. I've got the little wing. I've got some, all the other stuff on, and I've got mascara on. It just makes it a whole thing. But I want to do a different makeup look again today, but I want to film it because I don't want to think. At the end of this video, I'll, I'll add some photos and maybe some TikToks. It depends what sounds I used. Um to show you what I have done. So what I normally do first, I think I already shown this, I can't remember if I should sh shown you this or not, but I don't really know. So, normally I'll probably just go in with a wipe, if I can find my wipes, that would really make sense. But sometimes I'll go with, a, it depends, because sometimes it depends how what makeup look I do, which I go in with first. So I'm gonna go in with some, body lotion first to get this makeup look off it does work everything does work to do this so I'm just gonna put a little bit on my finger then you put it in the places like it will get all over because that's the whole point so yeah I'll add some photos like I've just got blue around my face but that's okay because it comes off and it just gets most of it. And now it looks like I've got a blue face. But obviously I do. Okay, then I go in with a white and just rub around. Also, it's good to do that because obviously when you do these looks, you put a lot of um, eyeshadow on your look. And it's just like, yeah. It just stays in one place and it'll take forever to get off so you've got to use something to just spread it out so i'm gonna go in with a wipe wipe my lip gloss off the hardest part for me would be the this line to get off because sometimes it doesn't come off but today because i only did it a couple of hours ago um it's coming off straight away so i'm just gonna wipe that off I go in with a couple of wipes because you definitely want to get it off, like, you need to get all the blue off, and I've still got blue, I've got a mirror right here, by the way, and I'm going to just be scrubbing my face. You can go in with more, you can use body wash as well, but obviously I'm not, it's not one of them, it's not one of them big makeup looks where I'm doing like a clown look or something, like I'm doing a clown look next, and I'm probably going to have to use body wash and just get a like a sponge to dab it off and then use one of these but if it's like if you don't have any body lotion you, need, you can use body wash it does work the same but it's just with deeper looks body wash works better like with more bigger looks if you get what i mean all the blue is getting off it's looking really good So now I've got all of this off, what I am going to do is add more body lotion to make you move your, your skin really smooth. I did a skincare routine, that'll probably be up eventually, I don't know what day it'll be up, but I know it'll be up, um, and, um, and yeah, um, I did different things to what I normally do, but it's like, It's just a normal thing, like you just got to do it as you go along, like what would be best for the look. Because I didn't really have a look on when I did my skincare routine, I just showed you it. So I'm going to put the body wash on right now. There we go, well body lotion I mean. And then I'm going to spray, while this dries, I'm going to spray. You kind of can still see so much of the muscle on my thing, because I've just finished Then I'm going to use a body mist just to spray around. 
don't you don't have to use it on your face but sometimes it does work for your face and it just smells really nice as well and then when this is dried i get some cocoa cream and it just helps get all the excess off it sucks in and then when you get in the shower or something it'll all come off very easy but also it just you can just it makes people see like it's come off just in case there's any extras that you haven't been able to get off you can just scrub some of this on and so far so good looking good So that's that. <laughs> that's me taking off my makeup. I've still got mascara on, but I don't really know a way to get mascara off. Sometimes I just go and rub it. Instead of pulling my eyelashes out, I go just rub it. But sometimes I don't because it just doesn't work half the time. But you know, it works. Um, it's okay to have some leftover mascara on because if you do makeup every day, then you probably have it on tomorrow. Or you, you'll probably get in the shower. So yeah. So thanks guys for enjoying this video because that was just me taking my makeup off. And yeah, love you and make sure you subscribe. And make sure you go check out this video there. And make sure you subscribe and love you and bye.